Chris, that game had the markings of uh, a game that meant something. Yeah, uh, a lot of emotion, pretty fast. Uh, I thought both teams played played hard, played well. Um, it was fun to be a part of it, and it was fun to come out on top. It's, uh, I know we talked over the course of the season early. As p- perhaps as frustrating as it was earlier, is it that much more rewarding now that you're playing the way you are as a team? Yeah. Um, We've talked about it a lot. There were a lot of things that we need to work on defensively, uh, not just to cut, keep the puck out of our own net, but stuff that jump started our offense, and you saw that tonight. Um, and if that's something we can continue to focus on, we're going to continue to have success. And again, your goaltender gave you a chance, like everyone else. I mean, everybody, there was no there were no passengers in that game tonight. No, no. Um, that's, that's not a game for passengers. Um, uh, you know, everyone was committed. Everyone bought in right from the get-go. Um, I mean, we, we talked about it after the Chicago game. That's a team that, that plays hard, plays heavy, plays north, and plays honest. So um, there was no room for east-west plays. There was no room for soft plays. Uh, most of the game was just advancing pucks and um, you know, winning lines, winning wall battles. And uh, that's what important games are going to be like down the stretch. So that's a very very encouraging win for us. So you think you're bringing mothers along again for the next one? Or? Yeah, might as well, right? <laughs> <laughs> I, mean, I think we can reflect after the year. Um, right now, I think we're, uh, you know, we're really sticking to the, the cliche of one game at a time and uh, focusing on the things that, that we need to improve on going into each game. So, uh, got to keep on doing that. Got to obviously gonna enjoy this one for a few minutes, enjoy it with the moms. But uh, we got another another game coming down the shoot tomorrow, so we got to hurry for that. Chris, you played in a lot of big games. Just where did this where does this fit on the scale? I don't know. Every game's a big game, especially this time of year. Uh, especially against teams in your own division, against, especially against teams that are competing for playoff spots. So, um, I mean, there was definitely an energy in the room, energy in the building. I think everyone was aware of the of, of how big the game was. Um, but uh, every game is going to be like this down the stretch. Every game has to has to matter to us that much. So, I think the last 20 games is every or 21 games, whatever we got. Every 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 game is going to be big, but we can't we can't worry too too much about the standings. I think we just have to kind of chip away here and. Uh, you know, we know that if we keep playing the way we're playing, we're going to win more often than not. And um, the good thing is, a lot of the teams we play, we have to catch. So uh, I think we just got to take it day by day. I think it's important we get on the plane here and enjoy this win tonight and be really ready to go at the garden tomorrow. I think it's uh, it would be really easy to have a letdown game tomorrow, and uh, we got to avoid that. And um, you know, coming off such high emotions tonight, we got to bring the same effort tomorrow. And um, you know, the garden's going to be rocking, and we're going to be uh, we got to be flying from the start. And uh, that's what you have to do this time. You have to kind of string games together, and that's what we've been able to do, and tomorrow's going to be no different. Did you feel like you earned the breaks, the two pucks that went off for defense? Yeah. You earned those by relentless pressure and made them have to move their feet and try to cover. Yeah, I agree. I think, uh, you know, maybe five, ten games ago when we were, you know, struggling to score a little bit, we couldn't get any of those. But, you know, we had guys going to the net. We had guys playing hard. I mean, I, I said to Colin, I think, uh, you know, we played these guys early in the year. We really, really got dominated. I think if you you look at the game tonight, I think it uh, speaks volumes to how far our teams come and how we're able to handle, you know, all different types of teams. We've we've played a team last game that's a high flying offense, and this team tonight's tighter, hard checking, and they play fast. And I thought we matched and did a great job. So, um, real proud of our team. I think uh, that's a big boy win. That uh, it's a it's a tough game, and I thought we responded really well. I'm really proud of our uh, our entire lineup up and down. It was really good. I just think that, you know, sometimes it's, you know, frustrating. You look at the standings and you can get discouraged a little bit. But I think if you just look at the way we've been playing, I know Quinny's been saying it for a long time and he says it to us every day, but our team, you know, there's a lot of games that, you know, early in the year we would have sat back and they probably would have had, you know, 15 shots in the third period against us. But I didn't think we sat back at all. I thought we were playing on our toes. We're, we're learning how to become a team and how to win games and um, how to handle all different types of adversity. I mean, killing off penalties at big moments and, you know, doing what it takes to win. I think that's something our team's kind of figured out. And um, there's no magic recipe to it. It's just kind of come together. And um, like I said, real proud of our effort and uh, up and down. I mean, we had great contributions and guys doing what it takes to win. And that's what it's going to take. How much fun do you think it was for mom? Yeah, I mean, she's having a blast. Uh, the, she's, uh, she's soaking it in for sure. But you know what? Um, it's good. I think maybe at this time of year when there's a lot of stress, they're able to kind of just, you know, we can have a little fun with it and maybe it's helping our game. Maybe we got to keep them in town a little longer, but, uh, yeah, it's been a fun trip and a very important trip for us, obviously. And I mean, 
you look at our last two road trips, things could have easily gone differently when we swept both of them. So, uh, oh, the like I keep okay. saying, I mean, real proud of our guys and um, just two two gritty road trips and, and a lot of gutsy efforts and some ice bags and some sore bodies. But we'll be back tomorrow and the garden's going to be rocking and uh, we'll be ready to go.